this is Joy and I will explain this match in English in respect to the people that watch us that don't understand Portuguese. So we were playing a rank match against a gamekeeper on Lakeside. I was the mercenary, Miza uh, this is Mizaki as barmaid, Madness as priestess and Kelvi as dancer. Okay, so the priestess was found first and she was supposed to kite first and let's see what's gonna happen. That was a pretty, pretty hard match we played. Look, she got hit fast. She used the portal so fast and then she got hit fast too. Now the hunter is chasing her. We were all decoding. Actually, we don't have too much experience against this hunter because we don't face him constantly. Then try to stun, but got hit and she's dead already and we still have five ciphers remaining. I was too far. I didn't want to use my elbow pad because I have only four, but I should have used my elbow pad here. I was too, too far. And I don't have experience against uh, rescuing against this hunter, so I should, I should have gone right away, and elbow pad and get there fast. Look, it's close to the half, and I was still getting to the chair, getting to the chair. Okay, I was in panic because it's come, it was coming to the to the half, and then I got terror shocked. That is so bad. Dancer is supposed to leave her cipher, stop decoding, and go for the rescue. If she misses this rescue, we've lost. Okay, so she's coming. Hundreds putting pressure, but she made a perfect rescue that was a pretty pretty perfect rescue and she was body blocking for priestess because she was dead on chair she will body block until dancer is dead and then priestess can run still body blocking still body blocking and then the hunter decided to chair me Barmaid is supposed to stop the coding and come for the rescue. The hunter decided not to camp because he could see the dancer. And he, want, he wanted to chase priestess. We have three ciphers remaining and the hunter hit the dancer. I was rescued by Barmaid and I was healing myself up and I was going to try to rescue now. I was hidden, waiting to get healed up. The hunter decided to chase the barmaid, then he gave up and he chaired the answer. In the meantime, I could heal myself and I was going for the rescue. Guys, believe me, I really panic to rescue against this hunter. That is so dramatic. Okay, so I could rescue and body block. I don't know why I was still body blocking for her. Maybe because it was so open and I wanted her to go to a better area. And that's what happened. So the dancer could go to another area. Uh, now we have two ciphers remaining. The hunter is still chasing the answer. And we were both dead. Princess used her super portal to get closer to the cipher. Now we have one cipher remaining because she finished the second. Barmaid is coming for the rescue. Um, the hunter is chairing me. So it's easy 
again to rescue now. She heals the dancer and the dancer runs away. Okay, the priestess is decoding the last cipher. I was chaired and the, and the barmaid is coming for the rescue. The hunter decided not to camp to try to chase the dancer before she got healed. And then the barmaid could rescue me. I ran away and the hunter was chasing the barmaid. Maybe that was not a good decision from the hunter because the barmaid was not dead on chair. Most of the hunters, they chase, the, they camp the, the, the last cipher, but he didn't do it. We had the cipher primed. So as soon as barmaid gets dead, we pop it. Okay, so we pop it. I went straight to the gate. I knew he could teleport and he had the trump card. So he probably was going to change to teleport. That's what happened. So he hit the barmaid, chaired her and teleported to me. I always go to the gate and try to open it right away when I have the elbow pad because it can run away from the hunter. And that's exactly what happened. The hunter teleported to me and I was running. Um, the only thing I could do there was trying to buy some time so they could rescue the barmaid, open the gate and escape. Otherwise we could get a tie or lose, lose the match. Okay, so I elbow pad away again to get distance. And I could stun the hunter. That was really important to us to buy some time. I knew the ba the dungeon was there, but the hunter had full presence, the tension. It's on lakeside and it's a gamekeeper, so it's hard. So the hunter hit me, chaired me, but the priestess used her super portal. The gate was open and we all could escape. They all could escape, not me. Yeah, I, I was dead on chair. And then we won this match and that was amazing because the hunter was really, really good. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much and bye.